Kawhi doesn't trust a lot of people, but I think he sits in that steakhouse with Jerry West, and he's not the coolest and he's not the hippest, but I think Kawhi Leonard trusts him. And Jerry keeps it quiet. Jerry West this weekend ran the NBA. Kawhi Leonard got a phone call from Cool Magic. Not interested. Got a phone call from LeBron. Not interested. Yet he went to dinner with 81-year-old Jerry West, sat across from him and said, I like you. Just get me another player. And so Jerry did. Kawhi Leonard made a choice this weekend, and it was a choice of trust. And you didn't hear anything. I mean, I'm reading these stories on Kawhi Leonard and Paul George, and this thing was going on for like 48 hours, and uh, not a peep. Not a peep. We learned that Kawhi does not want the easiest path possible, but he also does not want an impossible path. If you think you can be the face of the league, if you think you can be the best player in the league, how big of a shadow does LeBron cast over it? I think that affected Kawhi's decision. I think he would have signed with the Lakers if the Clippers hadn't gotten the deal done. So he made the best move for himself and selfishly for me as a basketball fan, the best move for the NBA because now we don't have a super team. We don't have where one team is a favorite against the field. We have a third of the league that legitimately believes they can win the championship. So is Kawhi, is Kawhi weak for recruiting Paul George? Why didn't Kawhi go to the Clippers by himself? If Kawhi is that dog, everybody say he's the best player. He's the new face of the NBA. Why didn't the hell he take his ass to the Clippers by himself? Oh, but nobody will say a word about Kawhi Leonard recruiting. But let LeBron James. All Kawhi Leonard did was the exact same thing LeBron James did. If LeBron tries to recruit, he's weak for trying to recruit the great players. If he doesn't get anyone, no one wants to play with him. So how does he win? Paul George is not criticized. Anthony Davis was. Mm. Kawhi Leonard is not criticized. LeBron James is. Mm. I just don't get it. I just believe he's in an unwinnable situation no matter what he does. Right now, I think the Clippers are the best team in the league. Their team fits together better. The Clippers are going to be terrific defensively. I mean, you have, in a, in a league where wing defenders is the ultimate weapon, mm -hmm. you have George and Kawhi, and then you got, at the point of attack, Patrick Beverly, and they have a better coach than the Lakers. Mm -hmm. Boom! We went from earthquake to bombshell. <laughs> he just did to the Lakers exactly what he did to my Spurs. He is number two and always will be number two to me. And in the end, I had to step back and, and applaud how brilliantly devious this guy was. He bamboozled everybody, especially the Lakers. Number two's ploy from the start was to sabotage what was going to be his arch rival.